Hello, hello. Um, welcome to the start of a new meeting vlog. Uh, it's actually the same day that I ended my last one, but it's just later in the day. Um, I'm off work now. I am sitting in the beautiful botanical gardens of Michigan State. There's a bug. <laughs> of Michigan State. Um, let me show you. So that's where I'm at. Um, you can probably hear the marching band is practicing, so that's nice. Um, yeah, so I'm still reading The Name of the Wind by Patrick Rothfuss. I am yay far in. I'm about, it's about 200 pages. Um, I want to get like at least halfway done with this, so like another 100 pages at least today. Maybe a little bit more later. Um, I'm not really sure. But we'll see. Um, yeah, but it's just, it's so nice today. I didn't want to go directly home after work. I wanted to be outside and to read. So here I am. Oh, yeah. Okay, so something that I realized today that, like, is sad, but it's fine. Um, I'm basically like an off brand witty novels. And, like, I'm flattering myself by saying that. Like, I know, because, like, witty novels is, like, Gucci and I'm like Walmart but like it's cool like I love her she's a queen but like I just like realized that today because I was like watching one of her videos and like something happened in one of them and like I was like oh this is what I would say and then like she said it and I was like wow we are the same person wow that's so cool I love her um I just thought that was funny like Whitney if you ever see this you won't see this um but if you ever do like Sisters from different misters, I guess. It's, I don't know. Hello, hello. It is a beautiful day here in good old East Lansing. Um, I am going to work. I just kind of wanted to talk for a second. I broke my bike, which is why I'm walking. I normally ride my bike to work, but it's broken. Um, I'm in a reading slump. I, the Song of Achilles wrecked me. Like, it literally just put me in a huge reading slump. Like, that's okay, but not ideal. I'm about halfway through The Name of the Wind by Patrick Rothfuss. Um, yeah. I don't know. Hello, um, it is much later in the day. I am back at home. The last clip you would have seen would have been me at Starbucks, where they misspelled my name, but whatever. I get patty a lot. I must not enunciate well. <laughs> um, I got quite a bit of reading done. Um, I'm definitely in a slump, like, but I'm getting out of it because, like, the end of this is, like, getting really good. It was kind of slow to start with, but, like, and, like, I kind of think that's the point, is that, like, because it's him telling the story of himself, basically. And so, like, I kind of think that's the point. Like, it's, like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm rambling. But since I got home, I haven't really done any reading. Um, I definitely have just been playing 2048. Like, it's an actual problem. <laughs> that's all I've been doing. Um, and I have been watching a friend stream on Twitch. Uh, hashtag mumble mage no hashtag i don't know why i said that um but if you watch twitch he's mumble mage you should go follow him he's really cool uh, we went to high school together i he's great he's such a good friend love him so much shout out um anyway yeah so that's what i've been doing so i've been procrastinating but now i have noodles and company on the way because i don't have any food because i'm going home next week and i underestimated the amount of food that i would eat in a week and so i like don't want to go to the grocery store to get more food because I don't want it in the fridge but I also am just like hungry and I need to eat so yeah I have noodles and company on the way um I'm gonna try and get more reading done but 
we'll see how that goes so my dinner is here i got shrimp pad thai from noodles and company and i'm gonna watch some more twitch and then eat some more i did it i finally finished the name of the wind um finished the name of the wind started Bored and Crime by Trevor Noah, which is his like memoir autobiography. Um, amazing. Like I, I'm not even quite halfway through. Freaking incredible. It's amazing. Love it so much. It's the literal best. Uh, yeah. I'm the worst and I bought more books but it's cool um I'm going to show you now um it's just three I promise that's a good angle it's just three I promise um so first I bought The Burning Maze by Rick Riordan which is the third book in the Trials of Apollo and uh, it's signed I don't have any signed Rick Riordan books, but I do now. I do now, so I had to buy it. Um, thank you, Schuler Books, for providing that to me, signed. Um, and also, while I was there, I'm trash and couldn't resist, and I got a book called Ithaca, which I know nothing about, except that it's Greek, and it's about Odysseus' son and his wife, Penelope. Um, I can't say his son's name, but it's cool. <laughs> Um, and then I have a gift card to my school's bookstore, but like, I don't buy my books there because it's too expensive. Um, but I bought this book, um, Simon vs. the Homo Sapiens Agenda by Becky Albertelli. Um, it is a movie tie-in edition, which is not what I wanted, but it was basically free because I had a gift card and so I thought, why not? It's one that I've really wanted to read, so i don't know <laughs> i'm somebody send help i'm definitely filming this in a parking lot and i don't know how great the audio is gonna be because like there's a huge like busy street right in front of me but emma books just made a vine book tag and like tagged my video on twitter and like i just am so excited like i love that this community is like so supportive and that like they're so wonderful and kind and creative. Like, she's the second person to ask to make like a different, or to, she's the second person to make a different Vine book tag than the one that I made a few months ago on my channel. And like, I love that. I love that people are like bringing all these different forms of media together and they're combining them and they're showing their love in like such cool and creative ways. Um, and yeah, and like, she followed me on Twitter. So like, Emma, if you're watching this, you're probably not, but like, thank you so much. Uh, it just like, it made my day, you know, just to be like recognized as like a smaller creator. Like I have 38 subscribers and like just for you to, just for her to have like recognized me as like a creator and as someone who like is her equal, like that was just really cool for me. And I really appreciated that. Um, and it just made me really, really grateful to be a part of this fantastic community. So thank you so much. Hello. Um, same day, like 20 minutes later. Um, so update. I finished Trevor Noah's autobiography, Born a Crime. It was astounding. It was poignant and powerful and it was so funny. He's a comedian. And so like, if you don't know Trevor Noah, if you don't watch The Daily Show, um, I would still really recommend picking up this book. He grew up in South Africa, and so it's just, it's stories of him growing up colored during apartheid, having a white dad and a black mom. And it's just, it's so powerful and it's hilarious. It's, I flew right through it. It's less than 300 pages. It's super, super short. Um, and I started reading Simon vs. the Homo Sapiens Agenda by Becky Albertalli. I'm about mm, like 130 pages in. I am flying through that one. I don't know how I feel about it yet. Um, it's cute, but it, I, it's not hype. Like everybody hyped it up so much and it's not what I was expecting, but we'll see. I'm not quite halfway through, so we'll see. Um, 
but this is going to be it for this vlog this is the official end i am traveling home tomorrow and so i'm going to be starting a new vlog kind of like a travel one and so you guys will get to see where i live where i grew up um and so i think that'll be really cool so anyway thank you so much for watching um if you like this be sure to thumbs up and subscribe um that is going to be it thank you so much for watching